Yeah. Wait. Mic's on? Yeah. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Uh, welcome back to the best channel on YouTube. If you forgot who I am, how could you? I missed one day. Uh, that does not mean it's the end of the fucking world, okay? I missed the day. I'm sorry. Uh, yesterday was a little crazy. I went into work early and left late, so just didn't really have uh, the time to do it. I could have woken up earlier, but I didn't know that I was going to be called in early, so uh, didn't get to go to the gym. Still did cardio. Uh, I actually just did cardio not too long ago, probably about an hour and a half ago. Um, then we're going to head to the gym to do chest now. It's going to be a quicker chest day. I don't want to do anything too crazy. It's going to be, it's only three movements. Uh, it's incline bench, incline fly, and hammer strength chest press. I'm not going to overcomplicate it. I'm going to do probably four sets of each. Um, very intense, very hard, nothing slacking, obviously. It's still going to be a good chest day with a good pump. Um, then, I'll do lateral, then I'm going to do lateral raises after, obviously. But um, the biggest thing for me today is going to be my focus. I'm not, uh, the last time that I was super, super focused was the day that I took the uh, Stim Daddy Pre. I'm taking Godzilla, I actually have a pretty cool pre-make today. It's pretty goddamn good, try it if you want. It's a, uh, what is it? It's a strawberry, uh, the the Starburst Ice with, uh, with Godzilla Green Apple Pre and Watermelon Candy Pump Daddy. So Green Apple, Strawberry, Watermelon. I mean, just try that. Like that's pretty freaking insane, man. Pretty freaking insane. It, it was, it's, it's, so far it's hitting right now. I could probably chug this whole thing right now. I, actually, no, fuck it. I'm gonna chug it. Ready? You guys ready? Chug down. Ready? Chug, 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 chug. Never ever chugged in my life. I mean, water. Like, I was like 12 and I used to think it was cool to chug water. I was like, bro, hey, watch the, bro, but watch this though. I can chug a water bottle, bro. Watch. Like, watch. Pause on that. Um, but yeah, here we go. It's almost pretty, pretty full. Let's say over halfway. Now, ah, uh, oh, so close. Pause. Uh, oh, let me. My brain fucking hurt. Holy shit. Ah. Uh, all right. Well. Oh, my brain. That was a lot. Probably shouldn't have done that. That was probably a bad idea. But. I, who cares, right? Who's, who's gonna, who on this channel is gonna stop me from making stupid decisions? Because it's not me. It sure as hell isn't TJ or Allen. So, I don't know who else is gonna fucking stop me from making these fucking decisions, but. Uh, all that hurt. Okay, uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, uh, today's chest day. I'm gonna do a lot of raises after. I was saying something about something. I don't remember that I got distracted by my pre workout. Oh, 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 yeah. The weirdest thing is happening right now. I'm eating on the deficit and I'm doing my cardio, but for some reason I'm gaining weight. Like I, I've gained about maybe about a pound and a half since the start of the cut, which I don't know if that's just like the residual uh, bulk, still bulking, or if I need to cut back on the calories more, which would be a little crazy because I'm eating, a, I think I'm eating 2,400, which is about half of what I was eating on the bulk. Oh, a little bit more than half, um, but uh, I don't know. I'm gonna stay at this. I'm gonna stay at this calorie uh, goal for about another week or two, uh, and then if I'm still putting on weight, I'll cut it again. But I, I don't think that I should be gaining, especially when I know that I'm eating less than I was. Um, on the like I know for a fact I'm eating less than I was on the bulk, which is weird. But I mean. You guys are gonna call me fat anyway. Was, who gives a fuck? Everything I do, you're huge. You're fat. Huge. Fat. He's dumb. Get him out. He's dumb and huge. Shout out Trump. That boy took a bullet for this country. America. See you guys in the gym. I'm sorry. You know, a lot of people give up like right before they get achieve that goal. People quit and they give up, right? And I'm not gonna let myself be that person to quit before I achieve my dream. Because I know what I'm supposed to have. I know what my destiny is. I'm not giving up until I get there. And even when I get there, I'm pushing past it. I advise you guys to do the same.
one. I mean, obviously it was too much, but I still wanted that 20. All right. Um, I'm going to keep it here, though, because I liked how that felt. So we're going to rock with the 70s. Exactly why I didn't go up. I knew that I was gonna get fatigued quickly on the second set. All right, we'll do two more. One regular and one drops out with the 45s. It's gonna be a drop set with the 45s. Huh. Let's go. Ideally 10, and then we'll do maybe four or five with the 45. That's what we're going for. Next up, incline machine kick flies. These, uh, like I said in the car, the whole point of these is gonna be intensity, but at the same time, it's gonna be really form focused. So I'm gonna squeeze at the top and get a really slow eccentric part of the movement. Right? I don't wanna 
let the weight just drop because, well, multiple reasons. One, that's how you get hurt. Two, it's uh, not healthy for you. So we're gonna make sure that these entries keep us going. Make sure that you squeeze the top. but not least three sets of flat press. I wanted to do a different machine, but it was taken. So we're gonna use this one. Um, I used this one last chest day and it felt pretty nice. Uh, I'm gonna do a little bit different last time. I used the neutral grip handles. I'm gonna use the flat handles.
and go really slow and control. I mean, holy shit. <laughs> Pretty fucking cool. More side chest. <clears throat> All right. I'm gonna do side delts. See you guys in the car. All right. Look at the lighting and the, oh. Wait, I'm kind of cute. What are we talking about? What are we talking about here, man? What are we talking about? Uh, sorry, got a fucking business text. Um, great chest day. Like I said, it didn't have to be anything crazy. Didn't have to be anything ridiculous. Just get in there, work hard. Push yourself, do the basics, and get it done, man. A lot of the times, that's all a workout has to be. Not every workout is going to be uh, fucking 45 sets of super intense hard lifts. Like, that was what? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That was what? Ten sets of chest? And you guys saw the pump. I mean, th th that's obviously not the only indicator of a good workout, but it definitely is a indicator of a good workout. And the fact that I got that kind of a pump, doing only ten movements, it should show you just the importance of intensity and the importance, the importance of consistency in your lifts, right? If you're lifting every day and you're doing it half-assed, you're not gonna do very well, even if you are doing 20, 30 sets. It's super important to have balance between 
uh, between intensity, but also understanding volume, right? You can't go super intense for 20 sets because that's also not going to help, right? You're going to outwork yourself. You're going to overjudge yourself. You're going to hurt yourself, right? Like I said yesterday, anywhere in eight, anywhere in the eight to 15 sets per specific body part is usually where I want to be because any less than that I don't feel like is enough and any more than that I feel like I'm doing too much and I may hurt myself. So just just try your best to understand things like that, man. And take into account all the um, take into account all the things that could go wrong and that do that. All things that could go wrong, all things that can't go wrong, right, when it comes to lifting. And if you do that, you will be set, man. It's 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 not the hardest thing in the world to concept. It's a, it's a great, great thing to have. Um, the gym, it's a great thing to have, man, because it can distract you from so much stuff, but also improve your uh, body health, your mental health, and so many other things, bro. So even if it's not the gym, right, even if you're looking for something to, you know, get your mind off, oops, to get your mind off of things consistently and kind of find that uh, that balance in your life. Even if it's not the gym, look for something, man. It's so important to have something. So, at the end of the day, who really cares what we're talking about, man? We just, we get out of here, we, we, we work. You and me, we work. We work hard, we work our tails off. And no one can take that from us. Love you guys, see you tomorrow.